All right, like I said, I got some. Uh, I've got some damaged gullies now that I need to repair. These pockets, they've all uh, cracked out, split out. Balls are falling through the back. Got to go ahead and remove that whatever's left over of this pocket. Um, might be different on everybody else's table. I've got a one eighth Allen to extract these screws from the side. It's a uh, valley pool table. Couldn't really get my drill up in here very well. Chose to use this little ratchet, mini ratchet. See, I got some metal washers here to pop out. Maybe not everybody's table's the same. Got some staples down here I'm going to go ahead and extract. get a bite on this one. Don't think so I'm gonna have to use a knife. Clear some of the rubber out of the inside. There we go. Don't want to break my blade, so I'm gonna go back to the pliers. Just see how it fits. Not bad. I got these from Ozone Billiards. Or, uh, let me check. Yeah, Ozone Billiards. Should work out. Um, I'm just going to position it where I think it needs to be. Try and line up where the old screw was and give myself a reference point mark. Same thing here. Height. Now that I got my two marks, try and take a drill bit and drill through the rubber. and put my uh, screws back through the hole. Pray my alignment's close enough. Got our rubber, so they should have some flexibility. being a little stubborn, so I'm going to go ahead and put it on the drill to try and run it in. There we go. Alright. Back on my ratchet. Tight enough to hold that I don't lose my screw. 
but not so much that I pull it straight through the entire pocket. And tight enough I don't lose the screws in the table again. Alright. Looks pretty good. So that's how you put the pockets in. Everything else is going to go just the same in a similar fashion.